Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Gallagher War in the East. So, we have a mission today, and that mission is to complete the encirclement of this force here. I'm not entirely sure how many men are actually here. Considering there's uh, quite a lot of divisions here, I'm uh, going to assume there's a good couple hundred thousand men here. And I would like to see that closed. Hmm. Right, that's good. Okay, you're out of movement. I need to open this gap. Only scout the routed men. How can they hold? Bum, bum, ba ba bum. Good. I need somebody who can move now. Right, we have movement over here. Need to close ranks. Uh, you could make it a little bit further. Okay, move uh, up the HQs. So we also need to rescue our men over here. That can be achieved. First we should do some reconnaissance, I always forget. Oh, we only have the constants over here. Mm, that's a shame. Oh well, it'll help, I suppose. <laughs> right. There we go, we just rotated a few airfields there. Very nice. Basically trying to form a line here. Okay, so the idea here is basically we encircle this group. So I'm going to bring up the uh, drawer in here. Yes, so we're going to sweep in here with the panzers. Our forces over here have already pushed to about this extent. So all we need to do now is seal this pocket. We also do need to, of course, make sure that we can hold this corridor open. But I think that will be possible. I think it should be very possible. We do have a lot of forces remaining. So we're going to carry this onto here and seal the fate of this force. I, uh, I don't know how many men are here. I'm going to assume it's going to be over 100,000, 200,000, probably. We're seeing armor here and here. Lots of infantry. Cavalry. Airplanes, airfields, all that sort of stuff. 
So, it's got to be something big, and I think this could really change the fate of the war here. And if we take a look at the concentrations... We have uh, men around Odessa here. We have this pocket here. Which goes all the way down there, actually. So that's a fair size. The men around Kiev. There's probably men down this way too. I wouldn't be surprised. But it's fairly open here, so that's interesting. Okay. Carrying on. Actually, that's mostly airfields. Hmm. Interesting. Right, what we're going to do then is we're going to secure our corridor. So every two hexes basically have a division. Right, there we go. Have the cavalry here. Now we do have this armor. Hmm. Ah, yes, we do have forces over here. Kirovgrad. Some nice resources there, actually. Hmm. We'll move this armor over here. Damn, I was hoping it would disrupt those rail lines, but I guess not. None the matter. None the matter. Right, we're going to split this up into a brigade. We just need to move it first. Okay, there we go. Hmm. Right, we need more men over here. Right. We're gonna need a division here. We need to get rid of these units. Right, so we have the Romanian troops here. Hmm. Right, that should keep these guys under pressure. Have that group there. Right. Two divisions here. If we can connect up to our lines here, we should be good. But this should theoretically hold. I don't think they'll have enough movement to get across. They do have these panzer... Well, these... Um, Tanks over here, but we do have infantry divisions to slow movement in a nice arc. So hopefully that may indeed be enough. Who knows, who knows. Right, we need to get these men out of here. But honestly, we could split that into smaller pockets if needed. Well, then again, I don't think I'd rather like to do that. be a lot of time and effort. Right. So we have Rifle Division. Rifle, Rifle. These are weaker, actually. I'll have the Savakian help me. Yes, there we go. Routed. Right, 
Actually, we might be able to drive through with the infantry here. These Slovakian troops are withdrawing. Now, which way do we go? Um, let's see. Probably towards Kiev, actually. I mean, we'll have ports down here in the south to help out with supplies. So that's, um, not too bad. I mean, there's quite a few ports. We have the port of Odessa, Sevastopol. Yeah, there's quite a few ports down here, all the way down here. So I think I'm gonna head towards Kiev with these rails. I'd love to go on a center path like this. Hmm. I'm still gonna have to go north anyway. <clears throat> well, we'll have to make that choice next turn then. Uh. Oh, we have a uh, Hungarian division over here. Lovely. Hmm, these men can be moved. So these are Italians. Not very good troops. Hmm, infantry over here. What a gap. Right then, now to move headquarters. Interesting. Ah, yes, we have the airborne. Yeah, there we go. Ah, god damn it. Um Right, that'll do. Ah, 
Oh, there we go. We can keep everybody happy. I don't like this being open, so I'd like to move something there if I have anything. And again, there's a chance here to disrupt these airfields, and I can't say no to that. Oh, not. Ah, we have a motorized vision here. But look at all those planes. Can we punch through here? I doubt it, but we might as well try. Oh no. Not enough movement, however. We'll get them from behind. If I could just leave them. Yeah, these guys are really under strength. Okay. Um, seems reasonable to me. It should uh, hold anyway. I mean, we've had to split up some of our divisions into brigades, which isn't the greatest thing ever. But it's allowed us to cover more ground, and therefore we should be able to keep this open. Hopefully. So, time to move up the armor. Now, I could go for a- whoops. I could go for a mad spree out here. Actually, let's take a look at how far we could move. Yeah, let's take a look at that. Could move all the way over here. There's a lot of resources there. Kharkov is the objective here, along with Kiev. But if we can destroy... ...this pocket, then that will be worth more than any of those cities. Okay. going to have to try and keep this open. Which is going to be difficult. Going to be very difficult. Christ, these guys can go even further. All the way to Chernigov. Or just the outskirts. Now the key here is, if we can destroy this army, then I will be free with my armor to move north. I think I'll have some of the infantry keep on pushing this way. I'm not entirely sure, I think it'll depend really. We'll try and take uh, the objective cities, but I think the main objective here is to probably destroy what we can before the winter. And, um, yeah, let's establish a defensive line. But with the loss of this force down here, I don't think they'd really be able to come back in this south. It would really depend. They'd have to send massive reinforcements down here. And that means that over the fronts are going to be less reinforced. Okay. Now these guys can't move as far due to the fact that they're in zone of control. Uh, so what I'll do then is I'll have these guys over here basically to keep the um, area open. Which works for me. Right, there we go. Hmm. Okay, we can leave a division there.
How odd. Ah, thankfully we have these guys. I'm not so hot on this bin as open. Okay, two brigades there. Yes, there's not much choice there. I need to get another division in here, perhaps, and then we should... Uh, should be able to keep it closed. Theoretically. The good news is the fact um, that the pocket is not quite um, open as such for the Soviets. They have to deal with these troops over here, which are, like, pushing inwards. So they don't have free movement within the pocket. Quite. Right. Now you can move all that way down there, but you can't move down here. Okay. In fact, what we might do then is have you... Uh, over here. Hmm. So you can tell the cities that have a garrison due to the fact that they'll have, like, the hex grade out. Could be on... Well, could be, uh, close. Only a few kilometers away from Kursk if we went over here. Right, then um, that should be it. The only weak spot is really here. Let's make sure they don't feel comfortable. Now this armor. Hmm. 
Okay, that keeps them happy. We still have more armor here. Right. Third Panzer. Third Panzer. Third Panzer. Um. Hmm. What I'm considering here is, um, trying to encircle these forces. We won't be able to due to the fact that they have a port, so that's something to bear in mind. There's men here. So perhaps a second encirclement that could be achieved. It's a little crazy, but it could be achieved. Lucky sons of bitches. Oh, I didn't mean to move both. God fucking damn it. Yeah, nobody's gonna be happy here. So annoying. If I'd done it a little bit smaller, I probably would have been able to do that. I didn't expect another division being there. But I suppose this will have to do. Okay. Yeah, see, so we could move in here. I'd rather let the lack of supply do my bidding. Oh shit, I did not mean to move him. God damn it. I'm sure will be fine. Can't really move anything over there anyway, so... Okay. Well then, thank you for watching, guys, and goodbye for now.